Hello Greg 8, this is the second video related to light and in this time we're going to be talking about the spectrum of light. Okay, now the first thing we need to know here is that white light is actually the combination of different color and that is what we call dispersion of light. Light, or white light, what we see is the combination of different colors. So that is the first important thing. White light is the mixture or combination of different colors. Now, these different colors will have certain differences. In this case, we say that they have different frequencies and wavelength. And for now, that is the only thing you need to know related to the different colors. They have different frequencies and different wavelength later on in upcoming grades you will learn about what is frequency and what is wavelength but for now you just need to know that the different colors will have different frequencies and different wavelength later on you will learn in detail about what frequency is as well as what is frequency is wavelength so for now white light white light is the combination of different colors. When all those colors come together, we see white light. The light coming from the sun is referred as white light, okay? And that is different. Those different colors will have different frequencies as well as different wavelengths, okay? Now, what colors are we talking about? We are talking about seven colors. And the colors of the spectrum are in this specific order are red that is the first one we have orange we have yellow and it's a little bit difficult to see I just wanted to use the color but you can see there it is yellow we have green we have green we have blue We have indigo, we have indigo, which is like a purple color, and we have violet. We have violet, and all these are the colors of the spectrum. The colors of the spectrum in that specific order. Here, you can look at the picture of the color of the spectrum. Okay? so. That is the first important thing. White light is a mixture of different colors. Those different colors would have different frequencies and different wavelengths. And the different colors which you have to learn are red, orange, yellow, green, blue, indigo, and violet. Those are the different colors and that is the specific order. That is the order. If you see here in the spectrum, they are in that specific order, starting from red top here and ended in violet there at the bottom, or the other way around. But always, those are, or that is the order of the different colors of the spectrum. Now, we say that when white light gets broken or gets dispersed in different color, we call that dispersion. And dispersion is when white light gets split into different color is when light gets split I'm sorry in or oh, into different colors that is what we call dispersion dispersion is when light get um, split into the different colors different colors remember those are the colors that we're speaking about it's not just any color it's those are the colors of dispersion of light these colors are the same that you see in the rainbow when it's raining and we call those dispersion of light so in the rainbow what we see is not other thing than the dispersion of light. These are the very much colors that you see in the 
rainbow. Okay? Okay? Now, we have something called prism. Now, a prism is a block of glass that can split white light into different colors, the same as the rainbow. This that you see here, this glass here, is what we call a prism. This is a square, a triangle piece of glass or perspex that can divide light into three different, into its different uh, color. That is what we call a prism and is used to disperse light. Okay. Now, important. We were talking about frequency and wavelengths. Now, the different colors are organized by either increasing frequency or increasing wavelength. For instance, the red light here, this one has the longest wavelengths and the smaller frequency. If we go to the violet, then it has the shorter wavelengths and the higher frequency. So you can see that is the opposite. So as you move from red to orange to yellow to green to blue to indigo to violet, the wavelength is becoming smaller, but the frequency is becoming bigger. Okay, so that is the last part of the video. I hope um, it did help. It is not difficult. We learned that white light is the mixture of different color. Those different colors have different frequency and wavelength. We are going to learn more about that one in further grades, those frequency and wavelengths. Those are the different colors that we're speaking about, the red, which have the longest wavelength and the smaller frequency. We have orange, yellow, green, blue, indigo, and violet. The violet have the shorter wavelength and the longer or the higher frequency. We know that dispersion is what we call when light split into different colors. We have a prism, which is a block of glass that can split light um, into its different color. This prism is generally a triangle, all right? So it's a prism, a block of glass or purpose, but it's formed a triangle, even though we have another type of prism, okay? So this is all for this video. This is what you need to know actually about a uh, spectrum of light. Um, thank you for watching. I hope it helped. And up until next time, good luck.